In the next phase of this demonstration, uh, we want to look at two specific areas where driveways are going to tie into the corridor. In these areas, we want to remove some of the components on the right side of this corridor. They will be the in condition components and also the sidewalk component we're going to remove in this area. After we remove those components, we're going to modify the existing height of a curb component with a parametric constraint. First thing I want to do is create a copy of this template here. We're going to select the urban template here. So I'll drill down into my template library and select that and locate this corridor. I'm going to snap to this construction line to start. Snap to this construction line to end. Accept that interval drop. And then left mouse click to accept all of those prompts there. Now that I have a new template here, I'm going to modify it. So I'll hit the edit template drop command in this template. These components to the right here, I want to delete. So I'm going to right click into space and select delete components and delete all these in conditions additionally i want to delete this uh, berm and sidewalk area as well okay now that's done i'll hit okay and we should see the 3d model update we see there graphically it has removed those components from the model now that i have that done I could do the same thing to this area, create a new um, template and modify it. But instead, I'm going to use this command called the copy template drop command. This will create a copy of this template drop and then in theory place it uh, into this area. So I'll locate the corridor. Locate my start and my stop. And then accept this and allow the model to update. As we can see here, it has updated and we have a new template drop here in that area. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and share it with others. If you want to see more like it, please consider subscribing to this and Bentley's other channels. Thank you and see you next time.